everyone, I am Rin of Lunatics Delight, and welcome back to Hungry Hearts Diner, a tale of star-crossed souls. Whoa. Oh, okay. Um, it's asking me if I want to take a survey. No, I'll do that later. Everybody wants food. Okay. I have, like, nothing out. This is problematic. Uh, fizzy pop, and some cola, I guess, and let's do something healthy. Let's put the tea out. Okay, there we go. Sorry, I don't mean to rush you. Ooh, all that money pouring in. <laughs> that was kind of satisfying to watch. I gotta put some stuff out. Oh my goodness. Uh, drinks, drinks, drinks. Drinks. Iced coffee. And... Tea. Iced coffee and tea leveled up. Cool. He wants some of those. Um, what is that that just popped up? Oh, you want drink. What is this that just popped up? I'm gonna click on this real quick. Oh, it's wanting me to watch an ad. No, I don't want to do that. I'm hoping we can get some interesting, uh, more stories. Okay, do we have any new interesting stuff we can do? need to be doing this thing, but I don't know what that is. I don't even see anything that looks like that. Is that a rice dish? Oh, it might be one of these. So what did it look like? Cars Toko Roten. I have no idea what that is. Oh, it's this. Okay, we'll make that. What is that? Completely tasteless dish of mystery. What's it made of? No one knows or wants to. Somehow a popular snack in Western Japan. Okay. Oh, can I get an upgrade yet? I've got 10k. I forget how much it was for the next upgrade. Let's feed the doctor, get him on his way. Oh, we have a story! Yay! The needle monster? <sighs> Why the long face, doctor? I'm glad you asked. You see... Wait, let me guess. You're hungry. No. Well, yes, but no. It's... How do I put this? Have you ever... Have you heard what the kids around town call me? Fat? Fat? I'm just teasing. No, I don't know what they call you. You have quite the barbed tongue, madam. So, out with it already. I don't have all day. The needle monster. Ho ho! That's a good one. Those kids must really dislike you. The needles are a necessity. I'm just trying to keep them happy and healthy. But still, they hate me. Honestly, I'm a little hurt. It's part of the job. Besides, we all know how many lives you saved. We're grateful to you, Doctor. Really, we are. Saved. Huh. You know, a long time ago, I spent my days giving what comfort I could to dying soldiers. I watched many of those who could have been saved die. It was a beastly world back then. They were really bad times, they were. Doctor, were you one of those sent to the Southern Islands? Yes. Yes, I was. Being called bad names by children is nothing compared to what you went through, though, right? Oh, I added a word there. Oops. I suppose so. 
Things are much better now. Really, peace is a wonderful thing. Okay. Close. I'm tapping to close. Thank you. <laughs> What's this one want? Pot stickers and tea. Oh, upgrades. I was going to look at upgrades. What was the next thing I needed? The refrigerator? Ooh, that's expensive. Was it the refrigerator? Oh no, maybe the side... Or the, the counters and chairs, maybe? Counters and chairs one. This one right here. Because uh, that's 40000 and I think that's the cheapest thing. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's gonna take a while. I'm. If nothing interesting happens for a while here, then I'll just uh, skip you all ahead to when something interesting does happen, just to spare you the money farming. Oh yay! New conversation. What's up, Slick? Your head is certainly in the clouds today. Something happened? Huh? Yeah, I guess you could say that. Finally realized that you should stop moping around here and go do something with your life? Hey, get off my back. Your tongue isn't as sharp as it usually is today. <sighs> it's just, you know, they lost. Your old school's baseball team? Yeah. They were so close, too, but the other team was just too good. The other schools got a rep. All the kids with talent who want to play ball go there. Too bad. I guess no matter how good you are, one star just can't carry the whole team. In the end, you're only as good as your weakest player. Damn it, the same stupid thing happened to me. I'm sorry to hear it, but cheer up. There's always next year. There is no next year, lady. Not for them. This is high school baseball. You've only got one chance to make it or break it. One. And me, there's no next year for me anymore, either. I'm... I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean to upset you. Nah, don't worry about it. I'm sorry I shouted. I just got so angry, you know? Look at me, yelling at a little old lady. I'm the worst. Advance. Thank you. It's... <clears throat> it's just things have been tough lately. Didn't mean to take it out on you. Well, I hope things get better soon. Sorry for causing a scene. I'll see you around, okay? Sure, stop by any time. I don't know what's troubling you, but perk up. I'm sure it'll all work out. Heh, <laughs> I hope so. Thanks. Aw, poor dude. I have no idea what he's talking about, because I don't know sports, but... I hope you feel better, Slick. The rice leveled up and I can make curry and rice now. Once I get some more stamina. I should probably put a drink out. Whoops. Um. Guess I'll put a cola out. That's all I can do, really. Oh, there's my grandson. I didn't know he came in. On I guess he comes in on Sundays, doesn't he? Mm, ma mm, Mabo. Says he's supposed to come in on Tuesdays and Saturdays. Okay, he wants juice. Can I make orange juice? I can. Can I make it in time? Nope. <laughs> oh well. <laughs> I tried. Oh, new conversation. <laughs> Scarlet, bad day. Ooh, this ought to be interesting. Ugh, damn it. What's wrong, young lady? Are you drunk again? I'll have you go elsewhere if you're gonna swear like that. Uh... Hey, Granny. Yes? Have you always been single? 
Why, heavens no, I've had a husband for fifty years. Oh, I see. I would never have thought. But wow, fifty years, huh? I've never had a relationship last more than six months. <laughs> Come on, advance. I'm clicking. Thank you. I think I know why. Come on. So does... So does that mean that boy who comes around sometimes is your grandkid? Oh yes, he's the apple of my eye. I don't know why this is taking so long to scroll. There we go. Oh, yeah, they're cute at that age. I wonder how Shota's doing now. Hmm? Who's Shota? Ah, forget I said anything. I think I've had too much to drink today. I'm gonna go home and take it easy. You're awfully polite today. That's a nice change. You take care now. Not to fall into a ditch. I'll be fine. Don't worry. <clears throat> I wonder if she's alright. Now, I'm thinking Shota is probably a kid she had. I forget if she's old enough to have a young child, though. But that's my guess. Ooh, yay, new conversation. Hey, don't ignore me, that's mean. No, it's just that I can tell by the looks of you that you're not in high spirits. I thought it'd be best to give you your space. <laughs> oh, come now, there's no need to cry. Did you see your father? Yeah. How was he? He looked happy. Well, isn't that nice? His new wife. She's so pretty. I see. And they have a baby. What? R really? It's only been a year since he left. <laughs> That's quite quick. I know. So what did you do? Were you able to talk with him? Yeah. Dad and his new wife were really nice to me. They live in a big house, just like we used to. And they gave me this yummy snack. And then his wife made me a rice omelet for dinner. A rice omelet, huh? Yeah. It was light and fluffy with just the right amount of ketchup. It was so good. Isn't that nice? And then I told them... Mom could never make anything like this. And then Dad laughed and said, She can only make ham and eggs. Dad said he actually doesn't like ham and eggs, but that's all that Mom could make, so he pretended to like it. And then we listened to Dad's favorite records, talked a bit, then I went home. I see. Did you enjoy yourself? Sure. I had fun. Dad and his new wife looked so happy together in their big, pretty house. They were both so nice, and their baby was cute. I see. But, on the train ride home, I don't know why, but I just started crying. Why do things have to be this way? Well, sometimes that's life. Why? Why do I feel so... <laughs> now, now. It's alright, dearie. Aw, poor girl. I think she's, like, feeling and, like, wondering, like, why couldn't he be happy like that with her and her mom? Okay, doctor's got something new. I dream of dinner. How could they? How could they? How could who what? So I just came from that Chinese restaurant down the street. You just finished eating and now you're here for more? Let me finish my story. I ordered the fried rice set, and I naturally assumed the fried rice would come with a side of more rice. But no, it came with dumplings. Lies! False advertising. That's not fried rice set, that's a dumpling set. I was so upset, I paid the bill and left, after finishing all my food, of course. So, in other words, I'm here to wash down my dissatisfaction with a nice hot meal. Now, what should I order? <laughs> oh, gosh! <laughs> You really love your rice, don't you? Of course I do. Rice is the heart and soul of Japan. In fact, I love it so much I had a side of rice with a meal of chilled rice last night. I bet no one else does that. 
It's just that you don't always know when or if you'll get your next meal. Um, but forget that. We have more important matters to discuss. Have you ever heard of... Oh gosh. Biftec? I have. It's just steak, right? That is it. Et etymologically... That's always a word I have a hard time pronouncing. Entomologically... That's my best stab. The French biftec comes from English beefsteak, who, whose use can be traced back to, so you want to eat steak? Yes, please, but I doubt you serve it in a place like this. Well, sorry for not serving the finest cuisine. <laughs> ha ha ha, don't fret, madam. I'll just have to find some other restaurant that can satiate my palate. Grrr. Well, that aside, what shall I eat today? You just wait, I'll cook you a steak that'll make you jump for joy. Okay, apparently I have to unlock steak. How do I do that? But that's under on. Okay. And... I have meat cutlet. Is that the same thing as steak? <laughs> I don't know. Requires that... Toko Roten, which is a side. And that is where? Here it is. I gotta level this up. Not enough space. Oh. Okay, I guess I'll wait then. And the doctor's back. I like how Pigtails sits there and eats her food like most delicately with chopsticks. I think that's kind of nice. And my grandson's back. <laughs> okay, I believe we are about 10k away from the next upgrade. 45,000? Oh, no, 40,000 for this thing. So, yeah, about 10k to go. New, okay. New conversation from Slick. What's he say? Ah, oh, those were some good suds. Hey, look at you, lady. You're extra beautiful today. Don't you try to sweet-talk me, mister. Ugh, you reek of alcohol. You're drunk, aren't you? Nah, not this guy. Just had a sip or two. A sip. Right. You're a lightweight, aren't you? Wow, how'd you know that? With age comes wisdom. And here's another bit of wisdom for you. Don't drink don't drink more than you can handle. Hey, don't be like that. Sometimes a guy's gotta drink to make it through the day. The words of a fool and a lush. I thought better of you. You just insult me, lady? Ah, come to think of it, you're right. I remember my old man saying the same thing and me thinking he was a dumb jerk for it. Your father drank a lot? That bum's not my father. Not anymore. He'd get drunk, beat up on my old lady, smack me around. He was the absolute worst. And the minute Ma got sick, he left us to run off with some dame. Never saw him again. I'm sorry to hear that. I swore to myself I'd never be like him. I sweated day in and day out to be a champion ball player. And then, that stupid injury ruined everything. Bah! But no use crying over the past. What's done is done. And now, now I'm stuck doing wor dirty work for bad apples. I'm pathetic. A joke. Now hold on, you shouldn't talk like that. And why not? Because somewhere, someone who cares about you wouldn't... Wouldn't want to hear it. Your mother, for one. My old lady kicked the bucket a long time ago. I don't got no family to care about me anymore. Wait, you know what? 
I think you're right. You old folks sure got a lot of wisdom, huh? Do you really have to keep pointing out my age? Give me the bill. I think I had too much to drink today. Sure. Take care of yourself and see you again soon. Yeah, I'll try. See you around, lady. Hmm. Poor guy. So he was trying to be a ball player at one point in time. Alrighty then. And then no more news from the doctor yet. Alrighty. New conversation from the police officer. Lights out. Hmm. Ma'am. Yes, working hard today as well, I see. Um, there's something I'd like to ask you. What is it? Did my father-in-law... Father-in-law's shop close down? Why are you asking me again? Sheesh. Heh. <laughs> Sorry. But it's been bothering me. The shop's lights are always off. He's doing business with the lights out. What? Why? He says it's because no one comes anymore. What? <laughs> It'd be disturbing to come across that kink cranky old geezer, I mean, that man sitting in the dark. That's what I said. What's gotten into him? I'm worried. I hope he's taking care of himself and getting enough to eat. He never had much of an appetite, you know? That reminds me. What is it? Oh, never mind, it's nothing. I just remembered a meal Sakura made for her dad once. That was sweet of her. Actually, they got into a fight. Sorry to hear that. Come to think of it, it was my favorite food. Which reminds me, I haven't had it in forever. Does this mean I have to learn another dish? Let's just forget about that for now. It's a relief to hear that the shop hasn't been closed down. A relief for now, at least. He did say that he was thinking about it, though. What? <laughs> You know, I keep tapping this and it's not advancing. There it goes. If you're really that concerned about him, why don't you just go and see him? I'm worried about the old codger, too. We've known each other for a long time, after all. Yeah, maybe I should. I just need some time to think. I've got something else on my mind right now. I see. Well, you can talk to him once you've thought things through. Yeah. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you for looking out for us. Heh. <laughs> There's no need to thank me, but just don't tell that codger about this, alright? We are old friend. What are old friends for, anyway? You're right. Come back again soon. I'll fix you up something real nice. Really? Yep. Just you wait. Gee, thanks! I'll be back soon, then. And remember to always be careful around fire. Yes, yes, thank you. See you. His favorite food, huh? I have a feeling I know what it is. Oh, really? Does that show up in the customer thingy? Oop, yep, I can make one of them. He wants Salisbury steak, though. Hmm. Do I know how to make that? I don't... That would be an entree. Do I even know, like, what I need to do to make that? No, I only know meat cutlet. <laughs> I need to level up ramen, though. Where is ramen? Is that in an entree or in a side? I don't remember. Oh, it's right here. <laughs> Make some of that, then. Oh, of course the doctor wants that. <laughs> Ooh, we almost have enough. Just need to make some more of this and some more. Oh, I don't have any energy. Ooh, so close. Ooh, we've hit 40,000. Do we have 1,000 over? Yes, we do. We are going to get this upgrade. Counters and chairs. What does this do? 
Ooh, it puts it there. That's interesting. So now I can have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten people in here. Well, that's kind of cool. I need to make more ramen, though. Because I ran out. But okay, we finally have that new upgrade. And I think with that, that's going to be all for this episode. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next. Bye! Shoot, just as I was trying to close out the game, Pigtails has a new conversation, so we're going to grab that real quick. Um, ma'am. Yes, dearie. Uh, thank you for the other day. Oh, it was no trouble. After that, I talked with my mom. What about? About my dad. About having visited him? Yeah, she was really surprised. I'm sure she was. And then she told me all about what happened, the side of the story I didn't know. She told me that dad left us because he had started a relationship with another woman. And that woman got pregnant. Heh. <sighs> I thought the baby was big. He was already standing. Ho ho, isn't that something? You know, I'd like to have a rice omelette. You sure do like the things, don't you? Uh-huh. I'd like to learn how to make it someday. And then teach her. You mean teach your mom? Yeah. That's a lovely idea. Yeah. Alright, just wait a moment. I'll whip one right up. Aww, can I make a rice omelette? Please tell me I can do this. I would love to make this for her. Please tell me I can do it. Is it in here somewhere? Would it be under the rice dishes? Or no, it might be under entree. Uh, rice omelette. It doesn't seem like I can make that. This is the side. Oh gosh. Oh no, I don't think I can make that. No, I don't have that. Well, shoot. I'll have to be able to, to I have to make that for her at some point. Okay, well, now we're going to end the episode. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next. Bye!